to people what they want. Right. <laughs> really move someone like internally and make that kind of impact. Kelly Clarkson appears live on The Voice amid talk show allegations as season 23 finalists are revealed. It's likely been an intense few days for Kelly Clarkson, after 11 current and former employees of The Kelly Clarkson Show spoke out about being traumatized by the workplace environment. Her daytime talk show is shut down due to the WGA writer's strike, but she had to face the cameras anyway, as The Voice went live on Monday night for the remaining eight artists' semifinal performances. At the end of the two hours, five singers remained, progressing to next week's two-night live finale, when we will say goodbye to Blake Shelton. If the American Idol alum was distracted at all by the toxic accusations lodged against the Kelly Clarkson show, none of which were directed at the host herself, it wasn't obvious during the May 15th live semifinals. If you were to pick me as your that was a lot. <laughs> I definitely know a hell of a lot more than these two. I came back to meet you. <laughs> Kelly Clarkson was all smiles as Holly Brand and Dee Smooth took the stage for their first live performances of the season. She expressed how proud she was for both of her artists, getting up to hug each of them as they left the stage and lobbying hard for votes on Instagram stories. It wasn't just her own team that she was cheering for either. Kelly Clarkson joined Blake Shelton, Chance the Rapper and Niall Horan in a standing ovation for Team Blake's NOIVAS and even shouted out the backup dancers after the trio Sorel performed as part of Team Chance. Following the Rolling Stone report about the Kelly Clarkson show, the Emmy-winning host responded by saying that anyone on her staff feeling unheard and disrespected was unacceptable, and she committed to creating and maintaining a healthy environment. How much I miss it. I needed a little... Mashed it last week. It's time for Team Kelly. Yeah. Please, Kelly, come on. Give me a chance. 19 years old, okay? And having that kind of tone and that... There's no doubt that there's work to be done on that front, but on Monday night, her sole focus was on getting her team through to the finale. She was partially successful in that endeavor, but the cowboy, unsurprisingly, holds the edge going into next week. When the votes were tallied, it was outgoing coach Blake Shelton who was able to secure spots for both NOIVAS and frontrunner Grace West in the top five. The remaining coaches advanced one artist apiece, which isn't always a given, with several coaches in recent seasons being eliminated before the final night of competition. Kelly Clarkson's D Smooth moved on in addition to Chance the Rapper's Sorel and Niall Horan's Gina Miles. Such a great coach for you. I literally believed in you. You are not only fired from this show. Easy on you. Give it up for our season 23 coach. Totally. Yep. We're going to help you guys. The Voice is pulling out all the stops for Blake Shelton's final episodes next week, including the return of his longtime frenemy and rival Adam Levine. There will be plenty of other familiar faces in the house, as well, to watch the cowboy ride off into the sunset. The big question is, will he go out on top? The finale will air at 8 p.m. ET Monday and Tuesday May 22-23 on NBC and keep up with all of the upcoming summer premieres with our 2023 TV schedule. That's how we present this content. Don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe. For the support of our viewers, thank you. Kelly, she's back on the show after taking a little break.